Good morning, children. Let's recapitulate the story. Wonderful waste. It's the lesson from Unit One of your English textbook, Marigold. Look at this pen stand. Isn't it beautiful? It is used for keeping the pens. You know what is it made of? It is made of waste plastic bottle. Look at these things also. These are also made from waste material. Aren't they beautiful? These are the vegetable scraps. You must have seen your mama working in the kitchen peeling vegetables, and she throws the vegetable scraps away. These are the vegetable scraps, or you can say peels of vegetables. Now this is the story of a king of Travancore. Travancore is in Kerala. It is the capital of Kerala, and nowadays Travancore is known as Tiruvanthapuram. One day, the king invited so many guests in his palace. So, when you invite someone at your home, children, uh, you cook special meal for them. Actually, you don't cook. Your mama cooks special meal for them. So, in the same manner, the king wanted special meal to be cooked for the guests. He wanted some traditional meals. So, he called the cook and he ordered him. To prepare traditional feast for the guests. Now, because they were special guests, so he wanted the traditional feast. So, what do you mean by traditional feast? A meal, grand meal, you can say, prepared on some special occasions, like the pictures. These are the special meals. Now, when do we prepare grand meal? You must have seen your mama preparing grand meal on some occasions, on some festivals like Diwali, Christmas, Pongal, etc. So, in the same manner, the king also wanted grand meal prepared for his guests. So, he told the cook to prepare traditional feast. So, the cook took carrots, onions. Tomatoes, beans, chilies, garlic, and curry leaves. He peeled the potatoes and all other vegetables. Then he kept the vegetable peels in a basket. Now these are the vegetable peels, or we can say vegetable scraps. Scrap means waste. Now, have you understood what do we mean by vegetable scraps? Yeah, we have the vegetable scraps. Now, you know what happened? The king entered into the kitchen to survey the dishes being prepared for the feast. Look, survey means to look closely or examine. So the king entered into the kitchen to survey or you can say to examine the dishes being prepared for the feast. When he saw the vegetable scraps kept in the basket, he asked from the cook what he would do with those vegetable scraps. The cook told him that he would throw them away because they were waste. The king was very angry. You know, he ordered the cook not to throw those vegetable scraps away. He told him to use those vegetable scraps. After ordering the cook to do so, the king left the kitchen. But look at the cook. He is so confused. He didn't know what to do with those vegetable scraps. He had never used vegetable scraps in his kitchen. He always used to throw them away. So he kept on staring at the vegetable scraps. 
Look, he's thinking how to use those vegetable scraps, isn't it? Then suddenly, you know what happened? An idea flashed into his mind. A flash means it suddenly came into his mind. He decided how he would use those vegetable scraps. Let's see what he does with those vegetable scraps, okay? Keep on watching. He took a pot. Then he washed those vegetable scraps very well. He cleaned the vegetable scraps. Then he lit fire and also put those vegetable scraps into the pot. Look what he's doing. There's a huge pot. There's water in it. And can you see the vegetable scraps? Now the fire has been lit. He took fresh coconut, chilies, garlic, and then he ground them into a paste. Ground means crushed. He put that paste into the pot. Look, he is putting the paste into the pot. Then he added some buttermilk, that is curd and water mixed. Then he stirred it. Look, he is stirring the dish which is being prepared in the pot. Then he added a spoonful of coconut oil. Look, he garnished it with curry leaves. Garnish means decorated. He decorated the dish with curry leaves. You must have seen your mama garnishing the dishes with coriander. So, in the same manner, the cook garnished the dish with curry leaves. Look, then he served the dish to the guests. Nobody knew the name of the dish. Because it was a new dish. Now the cook served that dish to the guests. Look, he is serving the dish to the guests. Okay, after serving the dish to the guests, the cook was waiting for the guests' comments. He wanted to know whether he, they liked the dish or not. Look, the guests are having the dish and then everybody said the dish was really delicious. They wanted to know the name of the dish and the ingredients also. Let's see the ingredients in a will. Ingredient means the things which are used to make a dish. So, a will is made of vegetable bits, coconut, Chilies, garlic, curry leaves, curd, coconut oil. Now, uvial became a traditional food for Kerala. Everybody liked it so much that it became traditional food of Kerala. Like on Eid, Sevenya are made. Now, let's see the traditional food in Tamil Nadu. Do you have an idea? No? Okay. Sambha, Vada, Paisam, Appalam, Buttermilk. Now what do you learn from this story? You learn that we should not waste anything. We should manage the waste properly.